Sneak. Arthur. Dutch? Miss O'Shea? Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You, uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. But they don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah! Dutch! Arthur! What's going on? They got Micah. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry It's okay, and... son. Breathe. They nearly lynched me. They, they got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging them. Here's open. Arthur. What? The fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't think he would, but fine, all right. Arthur. You okay, Lenny? Yeah, of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not Strawberry. Get him drunk. And Arthur, no crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. Okay, boy. Let's go. for nothing. Yeah, you look like you've been through it. <sighs> I'm beat. We finally get off that mountain, then this. Micah's got a crazy side off him. What were you boys doing? You're supposed to be scouting ahead for us. Slow down! We gonna ride together now, Arthur? So, you were saying? I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was... You worry too much. Yeah, just, just some business to attend to, kid. You know how he is. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. Then we ran into some fellas. One of them, Mike, knew. Drank some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. Then he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. Happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So you're gonna go get him? I'll come with you. No, uh, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about Mike. It was drink that started all this. We'll just have a couple. Settle you down and head back, okay? Here we are. Just one or two, right, Arthur? Of course, just a drink. No big drama. Can we get a couple of beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. And you'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Have one for yourself. Thank you. 
<laughs> mm. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy a stuff, but Micah... A lot Mike... of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. <laughs> oh, there, Dullards! My lord, you men is dull. <laughs> and leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People been leaving me alone for the last ten. Listen, buddy. You're a charming fellow. One of the best. But me and the kid here, we're trying to talk business, so could you possibly leave us alone? No offense intended. Ain't no pleasing some folk. Just, just trying to be friendly. <laughs> oh. Mm. oh. <laughs> That's great, partner. Lenny, Lenny, where are you? My friend, you know where we went? Don't ask me. Hey, Lenny! Lenny? Lenny, where are you? Hey. Hey, buddy. You know which way my friend went? your mouth, mister.
should switch to water, my friend. Lady, where are you hiding now? There you are, Lenny. How many of you had, pal? We're looking all over for you, Lenny. I'm Clyde. You got the wrong fella. Stop slumping off on me! Just go home, will you? Friend of me, Arthur. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Not you again. Again,
Okay, boy. Page Company Lockbox. Hey, you think you're a dime novel? Ah!
Just hold on there, boy. Arthur, Arthur, we are gonna need to get some food or money soon enough or we are gonna have a revolution on our hands. Just what did you say to me? Well, I, I didn't do it. I heard that. Oh, I heard about a massacre and a last surviving Indian cursing the county. Well, if they massacred people, then they deserve to be cursed. Of course. I'm watching you. Whatever you say. Bad mother, bad weather, something else. I'm about an eagle. Wow. Great Thank you, Mr. Morgan, for sparing me like that. I'll work hard. I am not a bad fella. You'll soon warm to me. Just see that I do. Oh, you will. Boy. Hmm? Thank you for saving my life. Well, yeah, of course. Let's go. <laughs> Arthur. Dutch. 
I need you to do me a favor. Nothing too serious. I need you to help Herr Strauss. I've been working hard, Dutch. I know. And I know Strauss's business is not too glamorous, but it pays. Please, son, for me. <sighs> okay. Herr Strauss, Mr. Herr Morgan. Herr Morgan. Herr Morgan. Mr. Strauss. You busy, my friend? Why? I'll cut you in. Blown in. Already? You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Robel, the small holder at Painted Sky, runs the operations there, badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Ah, and I'll make sure they see it in them terms. Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's ah, very again. bad for business. I just miss them so much. Of course you do. It goes without saying. <sighs> Mr. Morgan, you seem chipper, but where there's life, there's hope, my friend. And? Hi, Mr. Morgan. Covered in blood. Mr. Morgan. Move all it. right, don't get all worked up. Yep. Look at what we snagged! Dutch 
Archie's dog's body. I told you he'd show. All right, boys, let's do it. You got a problem, you best spit it out. Now, done seeing up half the saloon like that. You're killing Tommy out in the street.
I'll back you up on this for sure. I got enough idiots to deal with. It's time you left. You're as cowardly as you are dumb.
You want your hat hung? You're dead meat. You'll be all right. Wait. <laughs> Easy. Shh, girl. Let's move. Knock, knock, Mr. Rope. No, przepraszam, co pan robi w moim domu? God damn it. English? Uh, you me, speak English? Me? Uh, um, Silesia. Yeah, good uh, for you. Silesia. I'm here for money. You borrow from a 
German man? Aha, ja. German. Äh, äh, mein Herr, äh, äh, sprechen das, äh, das äh, ja. Kaiserreich ist, I don't ja? speak German neither. I'm here for money. Money. That you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Aha. Aha. Uh, Leopold Strauss. Aha. Uh, yeah. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. It's very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. Ooh. Where is it? Oh, no. No, no, no. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Potrzebuję trochę czasu, znajdę ci pieniądze. No, still don't understand you. Where is the money? Gold, dollars. Nie rób tego. I have nothing. Yes. I have your things. Okay. I have anything in here or out there. Yes. The longer I look, the madder I get. Speak English. Very valuable, good? Not good yet. Better be something no, somewhere. No, no, no. Yes, 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 yes. You must have come here with something. What you got behind there? So, sorry, I Move aside. Just so I can move forward. I'm kinds of dash. Here. Just keep quiet. Okay. That should about cover things. Hey, back up! Stay back!
Let's go, girl. It's all right, girl. Yeah. Mr. Morgan. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Matthews gave me a message for you. He said when it was convenient to head into Emerald Ranch. He's looking at a few business things there. Okay. Oh, he'll find something, too. He always does. Will you be well now, Mr. Morgan? I'm always well, Miss Grimshaw. Her face is red like a lobster. I fell and broke my poor lobster. The watch from my fob was picked, sir. I never get drunk anymore.
How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Called in on the small holder, Robo. Didn't even speak English. <laughs> good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's a pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. It's actually pretty good.